Well, a family of five is going on a full week in a hotel after last week's rain left them with three feet of water inside their house. We caught up with the family to get a closer look at the damage. 10 News reporter Gabrielle Hayes joining us now with where it happened and what the family says comes next. Gabrielle. Robin and Brandon, the Munson family says water started creeping into their home on Saturday and by Tuesday, several feet of water completely surrounded it and made its way in. Now, this happened on Dutchtown Road in West Knoxville. That's in the Cedar Bluff area near Pellissippi Parkway and I-40. Now, the family says the flooding started in their kids' rooms before spreading to the rest of the house. As soon as the water made its way in, they decided their best bet would be to stay in a hotel. On Monday, the water rose to about two feet and by Tuesday, it was above three while the family says it seems to have gone down about six inches, they believe about 95% of what they own is still damaged by water. Now, even with things that you know that you can replace, any parent, because we had the doors open, you know, shoes are floating, and out comes my daughter's shoes floating outside the house. It's going to bring any parent to their knees and says there are still some things they can probably save like clothes and some food, but they will have to wait until the water recedes to assess the damage entirely. We also spoke to the Public Works Department about why water still hasn't drained in areas like Dutchtown. I'll break down how that works and what the department is hoping to do in the future tonight on the night beat. All right, Brandon. Gabrielle, thank you.